I'm Storm Trek 8 Chief Meteorologist Ashley Brown with a wet Friday forecast. Rain, it continues for us on and off throughout the night. Not only do we deal with rain, but we also deal with some gusty winds and much cooler air that's sinking in for us tonight. Temperatures falling from the 60s to the 50s. You will definitely need the rain gear if you have evening plans here. And overnight, those temperatures down into the 40s. And by tomorrow morning, we talk 30s for the first time this season. Hey, looking right now and tracking the rain showers, most of the rain will move out late tonight. We're talking Midnight 1 a.m. before those showers completely clear out will dry out, but will also cool down. My concern for you late tonight and early tomorrow. This, of course, the chill that settles in the windy conditions, but also the patchy frost as possible tomorrow morning. We will see areas of patchy frost, not a widespread issue, but some locations to the north could dip to the mid 30s. So we're going to watch for that tomorrow afternoon. Although we have sunshine, we struggle to warm only in the 50s by 3 p.m. We'll see temperatures peak at around 55, 56 degrees for you tomorrow. So tomorrow morning, 38 degrees. Degrees. Tomorrow afternoon, 56, making tomorrow the coolest day of the season so far. Temperatures running 10 degrees below average at only 56 degrees for Indy. So it's a cool day. It gets better on Sunday. If you have outdoor plans, Sunday is a much better day. At noon, 56 degrees. We'll make it back to the 60s. That's still below average for this time of year, but closer to where we should be. We should be at around 68 degrees. So tracking below average temperatures for not only the weekend, but to start next week as well. Monday at 64, we warm up to 67 by Tuesday. A great day, but showers will once again develop on Tuesday afternoon. It's going to bring another cold front our way that drops temperatures to the 50s by Wednesday, but a nice warming trend in the forecast for us next week. Your Chapman heating and cooling eight day forecast. OK, so a chill settles in on Wednesday. By Thursday, we start to warm things back up and by next Saturday, although we'll track the chance of an isolated shower or storm, those temperatures back in the upper 60s above average temperatures. My advice to you tonight, grab the rain gear and I mean the rain jacket, not the umbrella, because with gusty winds, it's going to be difficult to hold on to those umbrellas tonight.